Volt Standing needs a nerf. And I'm not talking about the requirements to get to Volt Standing. The requirements, while boring and really stupid and pretty much required to have a friend, aren't the problem. Compared to the other trials, this one is the most unfair compared to all of them. Sure, the Bankai trials can get bad, but you can do the hit and run cheese tactic pretty much. You wanna know the cheese tactic for this? Glitching out the game. Yes, so the only reason I thought this one was uh, as common as it was to have POC Volt is because there's a glitch. But I'm not gonna be talking about the glitch, because guess what, once the glitch gets passed, once the glitch gets patched, you're gonna have to do it the normal way. And the normal way? I tried doing it the normal way. So I was doing really good. I was like, okay, okay, these lasers, these lasers. Okay, uh, look up and parry when you see them. All right. So I thought it was 10 lasers and then you're done. No, 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 no. It is 40 lasers you have to parry and you only get three mistakes. The fourth one, you're dead. You get three mistakes and you have to parry 40 times. And guess what? These lasers aren't on a rhythm either. These lasers come at pretty much random intervals. They're not like, rhythm based you can't just go f f f you have to go like f f f and then it just keeps going and just like random it's not a rhythm there's no rhythm to it and the parry system in this game is so ping based and it's so bad especially because the lasers aren't like actual projectiles they're beams so it's a lot harder to tell even if you're parrying it correctly you basically have to parry as soon as you see it and even then, it's sometimes the game just doesn't give it to you because of bad ping, and I'm not gonna be talking about the glitch, even though there's like a million people doing this glitch. That should definitely tell you that it's way too hard to do normally. Well, the other two trials, you literally just have to find a blue-eyed hollow, and that's it, you're done. You have your mode for your hollow. Who would have thought the most biased race gets the easiest way to get mode? And for Soul Reaper, you have one extra step. That's that extra step's not too bad, and the Bankai Fart, and the Bankai fight? Yes, that is hard, I agree. But you can cheese it. Also, it's actual gameplay. You're fighting someone. This, you're just parrying a laser beam. It's not a, it's not like a, like a bullet that you can tell coming at you, like in Deep Woken for the Trial of One. It is a straight up beam that's almost instant. As soon as you see it, you have to press it, and even then you won't always hit it. So if you mess up more than three times, you, you, got, you failed, you gotta wait an hour, you gotta go grip two more people. And it's just a slog. And I get you don't want it to be too easy. So here's a way you can fix this. Either bring the pairing down from 10, no, from 40 lasers to 10 lasers. 10 lasers is still a lot. My heart was already beating a lot of 10 lasers when I got to 10 lasers. 10 lasers is more than enough to parry. And it's fair, because it's, it still takes forever and you get three mistakes, so you have to still parry at least seven. That's fair or rework it and have you actually fight like the king or someone like the king's assess the king's assistant that's all you got to do that's all you got to do to make it fair i don't want this video to take too long but i will say this quincy's just got gutted soul reapers got nerfed but the quincy's just got gutted everything that was quincy related pretty much just got gutted your base form got gutted your let's got gutted Everything got gutted, but Hakata? No, we ain't gonna touch Hakata. Hakata is our baby. In fact, let's add a whole new move for Hakata. Jesus Christ, these devs are so biased. Like and subscribe, Zazels and Zazettes.